something that would bust your balls. Hey guys, it's Dustin with uh, RC Jet Addiction again. Uh, as promised, here's video part two on how to mount gyros. Uh, let's go over this airplane. This is uh, Peter Miller's King Cat. Here we've got two JR370A gyros. Let me get stabilized here. As you can see, this one is the aileron one because it's mounted in that direction. While that one is for the rudder, that's the yaw. As you can see, if you were to draw a line straight through the label, that's the axis of rotation that it's going to compensate. So again, that's the yaw and that's the aileron. So here we've mounted it. Uh, on the aileron it's a little harder to see, but there's a black plywood mount with a little triangle stock down here. Uh, it's got the stock foam tape rubber, double sided sticky tape, and then we've also got this velcro strap uh, looped over it where if that glue were to loosen up or anything were to happen, at least the gyro can't move around too much. But this is a very secure installation. Um, not the neatest installation, Peter, but it's certainly good enough. So uh, we're going to do a little flying on this airplane and see how it works. <laughs> 